Right. Hi everyone. There is literally something I've kept a secret for an extremely long time. And yeah, no, 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 no. Cat, stay in the bag. Just a moment longer. No, 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 no stay. Oh, sorry, sorry. I've got, I've got to deal with the cat. But um, I'll give it a try anyway. Even though there's no music. My life is brilliant. My life is brilliant. My love is pure. I saw an angel. Of that I'm sure. She sat at me on the subway. She was with another man. But I would no sleep on that. Cause I've got a plan. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. It's true. I saw your face in a crowded place. And I don't know what to do. Cause I'll never be with you. Yeah, she caught my eyes as I walked on by. She could see from my face that I was flying high. I don't think that I'll see her again. But we shared a moment that will last to the end. You're beautiful, you're beautiful, you're beautiful, it's true. I saw your face in a crowded place and I don't know what to do. Cause I'll never be with you. Na 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 na. Oh, don't, don't, don't worry about that. You're beautiful, you're beautiful, you're beautiful, it's true. There must be an angel with a smile on her face. But she thought that I should be with you. But it's time to face the truth. I'll never be with you. It's just another bit. I know it wasn't perfect. I can actually do better. But a bit nerves. Um, there's something else I want to say added on to this. Um, over a year ago, and this is dedicated to her, even though it wasn't perfect. Um... I uh, fell out with someone that I held very dear. And it was over a misunderstanding. But the misunderstanding went two ways because I had a misunderstanding that made things worse. So I'm going to say this. That I am truly and utterly completely sorry. I'm sorry for hurting you. Sorry for upsetting you, and sorry for everything, because I've seen it from your eyes and not mine. And all I'm going to ask is, please, have it in your heart to forgive me. Because I've been through absolute hell this last year. Really, really missing you. And all I want is my oldest friend back. Just as a friend, nothing else. Just listen to that song. Because I'll never be with you. And I know I went. You said that is not what you want with me. And that's fine. Hurts. I'm upset. I accept now. But what she doesn't know is I have been extremely ill since 2018. This year, I was really, really, I'm still not feeling great now. Um, my balance went. We still don't know why. Um, literally, um, recently, I found out that, um, that my blood levels went at 68. And I've got vitamin D deficiency up on top of a few other things so I really am ill <coughs> and because of it I do feel and it's not the doctors it's not 
anything else is just me because I've been ill every two years and I don't I think I'll be okay next year but the year after that I don't know two years after that I don't know that maybe just maybe that this decade riding into my 50s will be my last that once I get to my late 50s early 60s I'll be gone it was because of how ill I am. I hope I could turn things around. I hoped I could feel better physically and mentally, but at the moment, I can't see it that my physical health will get too much better. I'm going to try and try to turn things around with diet, with exercise, and do what I can and see if I can turn things around. But it's such a huge, huge uphill struggle. It's it's difficult. So yeah, this one's for her. And as I say, oh, I'm sorry again. I just I want to put it behind me. I want to see her smiling and laughing and just thinking of the good times that she's she's had with me, and not the bad. Because for her, she may have a long, long life. But for me, I may not. Till next time. <laughs>